All right, welcome back to Majora's Mask Randomize. And as you might have noticed already, this was not the finale last time. So, what is going to be happening? Well, um, I actually managed to glitch my way into Ikana Canyon. Now, what I've done is looked up in an online video, and I saw this video of someone who used a bomb jump to get on top of a high spot at the, before Ikana Canyon. I then used a, uh, a bomb hover to get into the higher part of Ikana Canyon, get over to the Octoroks, kill them, uh, get up to the trees by bomb jumping to them, and then get on top of the trees to also bomb jump even further, and then I was able to enter Ikana Canyon. So right now, I have the flight point to Ikana Canyon. That is not the issue anymore. And hang on. Okay, uh, now with that uh, having played, uh, so what am I going to do right now? Well, the thing is, I would love to get the Gipto Mask, but I can't get that because I need the Captain's Hat in order to learn the Song, Song of Storms. Oh. And uh, without the Song of Storms, I can't activate the Windmill, uh, sorry, the Windmill, the Music uh, House. And if I can't activate, I can't enter it, so I can't get the Gipto Mask. So, my one and only and last chance is trying to get the couple's mask. So, you might be wondering, why the hell am I going back to the, to the freaking temple? Well, you may... Oh, well, there I go again. So, you may remember that once I got the fire arrow, that the fire arrow turned into a Deku stick. And the Deku stick I could then use to uh, activate the bonfires inside of uh, the, 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 the Goron area after the kid falls so my god, oh, let me just continue talking a bit here to where you uh, uh, set the fire to everything and blah 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 and then you get the sirloin, oh my god. And then once you got the sirloin I can get the Don Gero mask and that's the thing, I need to get the Don Gero mask in order to get the ladder to cafe. Because if I don't get the ladder to cafe, then the, I'm, oh my, I'm not even gonna address it anymore. Uh, if I don't get the ladder then I can't finish the Anjun uh, cafe side quest. And if I need to finish that in order to be able to get the reward, the couple's mask. And well, about that is, well, um, that is literally the last thing I can get. I've looked at all of the items. It's the only thing I can get. Uh, I, I do have access to Ikana Canyon, but there's nothing really I can do there at this current moment. Well, no, I can't. Like, even if I were to get the mirrors... No, actually, wait. If I get the mirror shield, then I would be able to get inside of Stone Tower. Oh my god, I can. Okay, so if this is not going to be working out this episode, then next episode I'm going to be trying my very best to find a way inside of... Uh, no, actually, wait, wait, wait. Uh, during this episode, by the finale, if I don't have any way of accessing uh, anything further, like if the couple's mask turns out to, to, to be a dud, then I will use this to... Uh, yes, I know how this works. Wait a second. Could I exit the door if I enter the boss room now? You know, it's worth a test, because if I, if I can't, then I can just use the Song of Soaring to get back to the entrance. Yeah, let's give this a shot. I think this would be a nice way to test this out. Yeah. But okay, if this turns out to be a dud, dud couple's mask, I'll this episode quickly all tap to see the what the Gibdo maze was again. Like, you're looking up a map and seeing if I can actually do it. If I can't do it, then I shall... Well, then it's really the finale. Okay, can I exit? No, I can't. Okay, never mind then. I guess I'll just have to... Uh, okay, I will just teleport over to getting the... Actually, where am I going to teleport over to? Because everything you guys have already seen. You've seen me get the deck stick. You've seen me get the letter to the cafe with the sirloin. Uh, meeting at meet midnight. I... <sighs> I guess I'll just do the entire side quest here on my own and cut back to me getting into Sakon's hideout. And, uh, man, that's gonna make this a super short episode, unless I get something amazing from Couples Mask. But the, the chance of that is minuscule. Like, I don't see... Like, at mo I, the worst case scenario, I guess, is that... No, actually, the, getting a hookshot would actually be helpful. Hang on. Hookshot makes me able to beat the... No, no, no. If, even if I can beat one of the temples, that's not going to change anything. What does the hookshot give me now? So if I were to get the hookshot, what would I be able to get? I... 
No, nothing really stands out to me that I... You know, no, I don't need the hookshot anymore since I've already been in the Kana Canyon at the moment. So the hookshot would be a bad spot uh, thing to get. Uh, light arrow is the best thing ever. The Great Fairy Sword would honestly be a terrible item to get. The, the Massacre Sense would be bad. Uh, well, so, or okay, because it could possibly t t turn into me being able to get gold dust and then allow that to turn into a Razor Sword. And the Captain's Mask allows me to learn the Song of Storms and get the actual Gibdo Mask. Well, worst case scenario, Great Fairy Swords. I hope it's not going to be the case. But, uh, oh, wait, the whole reason I turned this... Uh, went to the menu is to get the fire arrow but okay uh i guess i'll skip ahead to meeting at sakon's hideout there's nothing else i can really do here so see you guys in a bit okay so i just in between stuff that i was doing i suddenly realized what does cow milk turn into i never tested that out so the thing is, is this just going to be like the bar's milk and I'm just going to get a fish from the cows? Or is there something special to this? Wait, what? Milk just turns into milk. Fantastic. Oh, no, no, this is the bar milk. The brother's milk turns into a fish. <laughs> Appropriate. Okay, well, that was all I really wanted to test. So, yeah, the cow milk doesn't turn into anything. I was in the middle of the cafe quest, and I uh, already uh, got the uh, pen of memories, and I was just waiting for cafe to uh, get the letter delivered to him. You know, I might as well quickly talk here while I'm waiting. I, I already opened up a website to check out what's inside of the, the, the Gibdo well. Bad news. The first door that we need to go through for both the Mirror Shield and the Big Po, they both require five magic beans. The only way for me to get magic beans is by getting the Ocean Title Deeds, which is only once per run. So, I can never go through that door. Unless I right now get the light arrow to open up the back entrance and go through it in reverse. There's no way I will ever get a big po in this playthrough. Um, in this, with this seed. Oh man, I'm, I'm feel, starting to feel hopeless again. Please, Millman, come quickly. I need to know whether I'm gonna get through or not. Also, one last thing, while you guys are just sitting here, what, like six minutes, five minutes of the episode, I've been recording for 26 minutes, catch dang it. Well, I've given the pen and the memories, and this is it now. I need to go to Ikana Canyon in order to wait with Cafe for Sakon. Wow, I'm actually gonna get to the end of this quest. My god, that took forever. Uh, wait, hang on, Ikana Canyon, there we go. Well, as you can see, as I already stated earlier, and I've already shown you with uh, with uh, flashbacks, I've already gotten the the flight point flight point. This isn't World of Warcraft. The owl statue in here, and well, that's all I really needed in order to get over to this side here, and then wait with Cafe behind the rock. And I'm just gonna hope for the best. Like this is either gonna end my uh, playthrough or it's gonna save it. It's, there's no in between. Oh, I'm already getting shivers. This is again. This is the one playthrough I finally wanted to finish. This is the third attempt, and I've been unlucky with my seeds. I've had offline seeds that I could just beat without any issue, but then we have this here, and I'm like, oh my god, are you for real? Well, one more. Wait a second. Oh, no, 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 he doesn't show up until the third day. Duh. There he is, maskless and all. Okay, good, that's a good sign. That usually means that everything went well. Now, the thing is, I don't want to resort to glitching inside of Sakon's hideout. I've had to... D oh, I hear footsteps. Yep, he's clearly coming. No, I quickly want to say that if... I've had it before where I finished everything, but for some reason Sakon wouldn't show up. So I would just have to glitch inside of his hideout and, you know, wait, wait, wait. Just to be 100% certain, I don't want to accidentally get noticed because I'm standing in a weird position that he somehow manages to see me. But I do want to say that 
I'm just happy that he is indeed coming and uh, I don't have to glitch inside the hideout. And I think playthrough 2 or 1, I had to glitch inside by jumping into a little, little crevice over there that it's very hard to notice. But, okay, open up your little uh, hideout. He is taking a sweet time. Okay, here we go. This is it. This is what it's all been building up to. Shit, I'm actually really, really, really nervous on the outcome of this. <sighs> Let this be the run saver. All right, and I should not mess this up. I don't want to redo this. Oh no, the alarm! How could you? To be honest, like, how did he fall for that one? That was kind of obviously a big button. Yeah, yeah, we're going. Thankfully, these are very simple puzzles, but I can accidentally mess up if I end up being very carefree. I just need to go and find that uh, that's rock where I can place it on the button that makes it permanently slow down. But for now, I'm just gonna have to race like normal. Alright. Thankfully, it's only a Deku Baba, but it should be fine. There we go. Beat it. And <laughs> nearly stood in that red button. Alright, there. And stood in that one. Perfect. Don't grab that, I don't care. Okay. And, okay, again, don't grab the Deku Nuts. Eh, eh. Okay, uh, with this one I believe I could have just... No, I couldn't. It was something like this then. And, uh... Uh, it wasn't... Hang on, hang on. Okay, yeah, that was that, but... No, no, actually, I remember. It was... That. There we go. I usually do mess that up on remembering. Okay, hello. Nope. Perfect, perfect. And this should be the last one, right? There we go. I'm, I successfully managed to do this side quest then. And, well, here's the big deal then. <sighs> Am I gonna get something to save my run now? Am I gonna, gonna, gonna get something completely useless? Am I... I gotta be prepared for the worst case scenario. Worst case scenario is the Great Fairy Sword. Best case scenario, the Light Arrow. An okay scenario is the Mask of Sense, so I can try to see if, if getting the Mushroom turns into the Golden Dust, which I will still do this episode, because it's already a bit of a short episode. But okay, there's gonna be a lot of waiting again for Cafe to show up in Clock Town, so I'm just skipping ahead to him arriving in Clock Town. Here we go, the big reveal. I am so tensed up right now. I, I don't want another failure. Please, RNG, be on my side. Don't frustrate me, give me my one chance. Please, please. I'm just kind of silent here because I'm just so nervous. <sighs> here comes my nervousness. Alright, I know that it just shows a couple of matches because it's scripted to be that, but... Okay. It's not the light arrow. Huh? Wait, what? What got added? 
I... Don't tell me that it turned into a Deku Nut. <laughs> no way, hang on, hang on, hang on. Uh, if I were to go through my document here... Deku... Nut. So, one Deku Nut turns into a Deku Nut. I never found the... Oh my god. All of that effort... For Deku Nuts. I am at a loss for words. What am I gonna do? I can't... <sighs> Let me think for a moment. If I were to try to glitch myself to get the mirror shield, that would be my one and only chance to possibly beat it. Or I could glitch myself to Stone Tower. If I were to somehow get, can get myself glitched into Stone Tower, I might be able to beat it to... No, I need the mirror shield. No, 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 I don't need the mirror shield for all puzzles. Maybe I can do it without the mirror shield, and if I can get the chest inside of the stone tower, I might be able to do it, but oh my god, that requires a lot of bum jumping, and I'm not entirely sure if I'll be able to do that. And I don't even have to hook shot, so it's gonna be even harder. I think this is the end. Actually, wait. I know I, I'm pretty much out of time. I'm gonna quickly run over to the bank, deposit the rupees, and I'll go back in time. And I'm gonna see if Fierce DD Link is able to be an absolute unit and make some decent jumps in the Stone Tower. Alright, Stone Tower. Again, I'm not expecting any results, I just wanna see what Only Link is able to do here. Uh. Hang on. Okay, sorry, had to do something in real life for a quick second. Okay, that's already some nice progress. So, as usual, Only Link is an absolute unit, but it's not working here. He's not jumping up. Uh, I can't do anything about that. Well, maybe. Maybe I can... Oh, no, wait, I don't... I can't bomb jump since I don't have any bombs on me. Um, what if I just jump like... No, that's not working. How long, how high is this up here? That is fairly high. Uh, okay, just for convenience sake, I just... For convenience, like I, I'm fairly certain I would be able to get up there. With, no, actually, no, I wouldn't be able to do that. Uh, damn it! Here it would have been nice to get the hook shot, but I still don't have it. And there's nothing. I, there's no bomb jumping won't get as high either. Because let's just quickly give it a test here. So I'm gonna go and turn into a Goron here. And does my Goron Pound even reach that high? No, it's not even close. Uh, I'm really running low on options here. Okay. I am going to go to the Gibdo Well and see if somehow this randomizer also somehow randomized what the Gibdos ask of me. I doubt that is the case, but who knows? Maybe somehow the modder thought ahead of himself and thought, Oh, you know what? Maybe some people aren't able to get through the Gibdo area. Let's see what's going to happen. Alright, here we go. So, you still want five be uh, magic beans, right? Leave it, leave it. Five of them. Damn it. There's a reason why the Majora's Mask 3DS remake doesn't have the number thing. Okay, let me just quickly go through my items on what I don't have. So I've never bought the Gilded Sword. Okay, well, I can't get that yet. I never got the Giant Wallet. Well, I can't get that without... Wait. Wait, that might be my salvation. That might be my salvation. I have an idea here, actually. Just give me a moment. Alright, let's see how this is gonna go. So, I open that up. We slide down here. Can I jump up here with Oni Link? Does not seem like it. 
But maybe I can with the Goron jump. I just sadly don't have any bombs on me at the moment. If I can just get on top of that, I would be able to get through. Let me just see if the jump even reaches that high. <gasps> the jump reaches that high. Okay. Back the hell up. Let me see if I can get some air, uh, some bombs. Uh, b -b -b bombs. Alright, this is my big salvation, I hope. If this works, I know what I'm gonna do in the next episode for sure. And... Well, that was just horribly timed. Oh god, don't make me get another bomb. Okay. Okay, okay. Not gonna celebrate too early just yet, because I know there's a few tough spots here. I need to just quickly test this out to see if this will work at all next episode. So, first things first is... Let's see, is this the room? That is not the room. Alright, over here then. Is the... Oh my god. Okay, uh... Hang on. Oh, actually, I also need to know if I can get them out of this. If I can't get them out of that, I don't- I'm not even gonna... ...have a chance. Okay. Oh, goddammit, not enough webs, uh, melted away. Okay. Oh no. Shits. I was able to reach a bit inside of it. Okay, okay, I can reach inside of it. Let me just at least kill this thing so that if I end up, uh, you know, reaching inside of it, if that would at the very least pull it back. Because I didn't hit the, uh, the sculpture itself. Okay, hang on. Okay, I, maybe I need to do, do more like this. Okay, that is doable. Now, the other thing that I'm worried about... ...is on top of here, because I believe there are some open- Oh! Maybe I shouldn't be worried about that. I think only Link can reach that. Let's just see. Uh, hang on. Let me first just get up here. Yeah, I think only Link can easily reach that. Oh, what, he can't? Hang on, let me just try again. Let me try again. There's even one a bit closer by. If, can I... Oh no, doesn't seem like I can. But hang on, I, let me just let me just not give this up just yet. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hang on. No, he doesn't reach for... He does not try to reach the platform. Um, does the Goron jump reach that high? Uh, that would be a nice uh, way to circumvent this. That's my last uh, thing I need in order to beat this uh, place. And that is honestly my big concern. L let me just first see if I even reach high enough. I think I do. So, if I place a bomb here... Uh... <gasps> I reach it! I can do this. I can do this, I think. I don't think there's a single Sculptula here that I won't be able to reach. Oh wow, that's gonna be something for next episode, because I'm sure as hell I'm not gonna do this episode anymore. I already recorded for 55 minutes. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Next episode is gonna be... I don't know. I hope it's not gonna be the finale, but we shall see.